Baton Rouge Police and East Baton Rouge EMS are both on scene right now at Liberty Lagoon on Lobdell near Florida after a water rescue. We're told a child was, report, uh, was transported after that rescue but is expected to be okay. We'll, of course, keep you posted. We have a crew on scene, actually. Uh, we'll bring you up to date during our later newscasts and, of course, on our free Be Our Proud news app. Well, the PMAC on LSU's campus was a buzz with emotion today for graduates during commencement. 609, including 16 faculty and staff members, were awarded their diplomas during the summer 2019 commencement exercise. Today's keynote speaker was LSU alumnus and chair of the Board of Supervisors, James Williams. During his address, Williams reminded the grads that nothing good in this universe comes from being stagnant. Now, women made up 53% of this year's graduates, men making up 46% of today's graduating class. You're never too late to go to college. There's no, no such thing as I'm too old to go to college or I'm going to feel out of place being, you know, in your 30s. Age don't matter when you're trying to get an education. All it's about is going, chase your dreams, have your goals set, have your mind set. Yes, indeed. Now, this was the university's 299th commencement. The oldest graduate, in case you're wondering, in today's ceremony was 69 years old, the youngest, 19. The graduation was one for the record books, marking LSU's, well, a really record day for them. Southern University also holding its summer commencement. Nearly 140 graduates walked across the stage for the summer 2019 ceremony of the F.G. Clark Activity Center on campus. Now, graduates received bachelor's, master's, and doctoral degrees in several disciplines. The school's board of supervisors chairman served as the commencement speaker. All right, let's get a check of the traffic situation. It's always